people welcome to today's short yellow jacket video as you can see if you saw yesterday's video I was talking about the little nest that hang was hanging in the middle of the big nest and if you haven't seen that one yet go jump back and watch that one before you watch this one uh, but as you can see it is gone I was wondering about that how it was spinning on there and stuff it just finally it broke free and we have was one two six there was six workers and the two queens uh, so I I got rid of two more workers uh, the morning that I made this video so there was either some out foraging at, or that they're actually the one closest to the head of the black and white queen is a young one so that one has hatched just recently now that we don't have that little nest on top we can see down inside of the cells of these a little bit better now as you can see there's some younger larvae inside of those and an egg in most of them so after they the workers hatch the they'll clean them out a little bit and then the queen will lay another egg in them I don't see the other queen uh, the white yellow and black queen she might be under the nest or out foraging right now uh, if you can see down at the bottom of the nest the, down at the picture uh, one of the workers is pulling paper from the dome again it's like they build on the dome and then they end up using that for making cells and things like that uh, keeping this population down uh, I explained a little bit in the end of the last video uh, that I'm trying to keep the population of workers down to a lower number because once they start getting a bigger population they started getting they start getting ultra aggressive that's why in August the colonies are starting to get noticed because they start getting large populations uh, that's why down in Illinois when I'm running my business in August uh, I get a lot of calls because that's when people start noticing like right now I can I have my camera right close to the nest and they hardly even blink at me uh, but if I left these keep getting their population building like I've killed four workers so far and we still have five there and it's pushing I'm probably gonna have to get one or two more of those gone pretty quickly or they'll start getting aggressive and like I said with it being at my garage door I can't open the garage door without them seeing me opening it so if they get too many workers they'll start getting ultra aggressive and then I will have to remove the whole nest so sacrificing a few workers I think is worth letting the nest live longer so we can get some good footage of it um, actually that looks like that might be the queen uh, the head at the bottom of the nest poking out or no nope that's a worker it was kind of threw me off when I first saw the face it's, yeah there's five of them in there so I don't see the queen must be out foraging which is kind of weird with that many workers the queen usually stops doing her foraging and they she lets them do it okay well thank you so much for watching the video you have a great rest of your day remember smash that like button and comment down below